It was the most uncomfortable night of my life. Oh, the first date back is always the toughest. You only had one date. How do you know it won't get worse? How much worse can it get than finishing dinner, having him reach over, pull a hair out of my head and start flossing with it at the table? You're talking dream date compared to my heart. It started out fine, okay? She was a very nice person and we were just talking at this Ethiopian restaurant. She wanted to go. Okay, you know me. I was making some jokes like, I didn't know they had food in Ethiopia. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this will be quick meal. <laughs> we will order two empty plates a leaf. <laughs> Nothing. Not even a smile. So, mm. I downshift into small talk and <clears throat> I ask her when she was, went to school. And she says, Michigan State. What? Michigan State? It reminds me of Ellen. All of a sudden, I'm in the middle of this massive anxiety attack. My heart beating like a wild man, <clears throat> like now. And I'm sweating like a pig. Uh, <laughs> Helen went to Michigan State? No, she went to oh. Northwestern. Mm. But they're both Big Ten schools. Uh, I was so upset and I had to leave that restaurant. Harry, I think it takes a long time. It might be months before we are actually able to enjoy going out with someone new. Yeah. And maybe even longer before we'll be able to go to bed with someone new. <laughs> I did go to bed with her. <clears throat> you went to bed with her? Yeah. So, what do you do with these women? You just get up out of bed and leave? Sure. Hmm. Explain to me how you do it. Yeah. What do you say? I don't know. Um, I, have a, I have an early meeting or an early haircut or an early squash game. <laughs> you don't play squash? They don't know that. They just met me. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, I oh. feel terrible. Oh, I, I am so glad I never got involved with you. I just would have ended up being some lady you had to get up out of bed and leave at 3 in the morning and get clean your end -ires. And you don't have a purpose. Now that I would know this. Why are you getting so upset? Huh? This isn't about you. <laughs> yes, it is. You are a human affront to all women. And I'm a woman. Okay, I don't feel great about this, but I don't hear anyone complaining, huh? Uh-huh, of course not. You're out the door too fast. I think they have an okay time. What do you know? What do you mean? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> because they... Because they... <laughs> <laughs> How do you know they really am? What are you saying? Eh? They fake orgasm? It's uh. possible. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here, come on. Why? Most women at one time or another I picked it. Oh, whoa, whoa. They haven't picked it with me, okay? <laughs> okay? How do you know? Yeah, because I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. You are a man. What's that, what's that supposed to mean? Hmm? Oh, nothing. It's just that all men are sure it never happens to them. And all women, oh. at one time or another, have done it. You do the math. You don't think I can tell the difference? No. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be ridiculous, come on.
Thank you.